If you like a lot of lands and you like a lot of cards and planeswalkers, smash that together. You got Bant lands, super friends, my friends. And I actually had a little bit of a challenge naming this one. The original name goes by Bant Lands by our friend Ivan. Thank you, Ivan, for sharing this list and congratulations on your mythic play as well. And I'm excited to break this one down for you in today's episode. So if you enjoy, make sure to like and subscribe. On top of that, if you got a question, if you got a comment, do let me know because I'd love to hear from you as always. And on top of that, feel free to join us in our amazing community and Discord server, my friends. All right, so let's get into it here. This one is crazy. There is a lot going on. Yes, um, when I first saw it, I was initially like, oh my gosh. And I'm still like, oh my gosh, because it is pretty wild. So let's talk about a few things. First off, it's got 70 cards. Yes, more than 60. It's a 70 card list. On top of that, we have 35 lands. So there are a ton of lands in this list. So covering two of those pieces, the third one is lots and lots and lots of Planeswalkers in here, my friends. So that is why it's really Bantland super friends, as I like to say. So I even here has done a really, really nice job. Really, really cool list. Um, and I would say this, we got lots of ramp here with Azusa's. We got other things like Spelunking in here. Um, we do have decent board wipes and one-offs to allow us to kind of play around different things with Sunfall and Farewell. Um, certainly with the new uh, uh, white that's got the Spree as well, you could pull that in here. That's also a six drop uh, wipe, so something to consider. That might give you some other options for survivability, so just wanted to call that out. Um, we are playing Bonnie Pal Clear Cutter, which I love, by the way. Um, really, really enjoy this. And again, so that's a really our big one from the new uh, lovely, lovely Outlaws of Thunder Junction. What is Outlaws of Thunder Junction? And we are taking advantage of Doppelgang here as well. So something a little bit different I wanted to give you here today, as you can see, the real plan is get a lot of cards, a lot of lands on the board, take advantage of things like Doppelgang. You got a lot of different outs here. You got things to remove. You got board wipes, those kinds of things as well uh, to take advantage of here today. So uh, again, questions, comments, let me know. It's a very diverse deck, a very diverse list. Really ramp into these things. Lots of different win rates or win conditions, I mean. Um, in terms of that, and it is, I should have let you know this early too, it does run about 60% in terms of win rate, there it is, um, and a lot of plays as well, which is one of the reasons why I wanted to run this, so Ivan's done a nice job, let's go, Ivan with a Y, let's go ahead and take this one in, now, obviously, well, not necessarily obviously, but one of the challenges that you will run into with this list is going to be, which a lot of the meta could be, um, at least for right now, uh, the mono red progress list or mono red aggro list, it can survive. I have made it work um, against some of the really, really fast aggro lists. If you do get the wanderer down, you can shut them out really, really quickly. You just want to let them play through a lot of the stuff. They, if they sit on it, um, they're, that's probably the better play. But if they start dumping everything on, you flash wanderer and you take them off, get the two go to town so there we go that's a nice start for us also with uh white sun's twilight um as well so all really really good things for us to hang on to plus we got tefuri in here we'll keep these now a nice thing is we got this comes in tapped so we do have to worry about mono red we'll see if i can take it down uh two or fewer other lands uh two or fewer other lands this is going to come in tapped so we actually want to get these in right away because regardless, we're going to run into tapping issues here. If we can get to four, we'll be just fine on some of that. All right, so this is the heroic list. This is the one that I actually, through my playtesting, beat. So we'll see. I feel like they're going to be, be taking revenge on us here out of the gate. Now, not having some of this ramp in your hurts, this is super, super helpful here. We get to play that additional land, so we will play this. Um, we're going to grab this. A three life is super helpful as well. There we are. Now, if we do get one more land here, we have the right setup. 
um, to get the Wanderer in there, which is going to be very, very big for us. Let's see how they do this. Gaining the three life is going to be super helpful here as well. There it is. We're not going to be able to take that one off right away, so we need to wait. We'll see where they go. We can't take the one that they put this spell on, which is going to be a problem. So keep that in mind. We are at four. If we can get to five, that will be even better. There's the draws. Now, if they got another one of the plus one plus ones, if they play one more, they don't. But we'll get the Wanderer in here. Now you've done it. Hat's coming off. A lot of players forgot about that card. Maybe. Maybe not. The here we go. Uh exile right here. Do they have something to keep it alive? <clears throat> they do. They do. Brutal. Brutal. Very nice, my friend. So now what we can do is I go like this. Remember your training. For each of X permits, we can add another one. We're not gonna do that. You gain life and create a bunch of these. We're gonna need to do that. X is not five. There we go. We got some life gain here. So we're not going to be able to block this one, unfortunately. The only thing we could have done was we could have played Tefiri, um, create the two there if we wanted to, as an example. Um, I was going with hopefully enough life to block. It's not going to be enough, unfortunately. They're going to get through. The one little thing that saved them. This card right there, Lauren's Escape, is super, super unfortunate. We had the right lineup. Like I said, maybe they were going to take revenge on us. They did in the first match. Let's go to our second one. We got it, my friends. But again, we did get to see the ramp. We got to see some of the Planeswalkers in there. And you got to see a little bit of the nuances there in terms of how it can do against aggro. If our opponent did not have that one card in their hand, it would have been just fine. We, we really would have. We probably would have played Tiberi then instead. All right, so we got good stuff here. Let's go for it. We got Ren in here this time. I'd love to get Doppelgang going for us. Now again, target permanents for each of X target permanents create X tokens that are copies of that permanent. Now this one here too is enters the battlefield tapped. So we're gonna do this. Got our double white in. We have our Spelunk. It did not enter the battlefield tap. There you go. Now we don't have a draw there either. Now we can put this in. They don't have any counters. We might get something to lock us down. I'm gonna do this. So here we got reveal the top four cards, put all the cards revealed this way into our hand and the rest into our graveyard. All the land cards are revealed into our hand. We could also go down and create the the guy tree folk, which is what I will do because I was worried about the flash. Exactly why I did that. So 
So here's what we're going to do. This time, we're going to do this. So we can get rid of enchantments, all that stuff. We're actually going to play this for five. Well, one. We can target any permanent that we want. Let's grab our ley line. And then we're going to hit their ley line. And then we're going to do this. Speak your purpose. And perhaps we can avoid We can grab another one. If we want to. Let's create another tree. For now. There we go. Now again, don't forget we have another one of these. Oh, brutal play. Very brutal play. So now we need to decide what we want to do. One, two, three, four, five, six. To make a three, three green llama. We can go over the top. We could play this. Artifacts, creatures, enchantments, and graveyards. We could just hit creatures and enchantments. It's not going to hit this, though. There's a problem for us right now. We could play this, play an additional land play that. Let's do this. Let's get this thing over the top for now. Let's do this. Onto there. There it is. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. We'll have seven here. It is so much thinning, by the way. All right, so here's what we're gonna do this time. We can play this. Ooh, we gotta play that first. Do this for five. There we are. We can go with our flyer again if we want. And play to get this on the board if we want. Play doppelganger. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That eight. We actually need eight. That. So here's how this one's gonna work. Go two. Um, we could play this and hit that again, but let's do this for fun. It's gonna be fun. Permanence. Oh shoot. Uh, one. Not what I wanted. Alright, we'll do this one, unfortunately. Alright, we'll keep it. I lied. Um, we'll do this. We can still do that. We have this available. Wait on it. Fast control. comes in, view battlefield, can remove a target, grab that though, 
All right, so we have Jace. We have this. We can also wipe creatures. Let's do that. Vax creatures and well, if we hit our graveyard, we'll still have our deluge. They don't have anything in there, so we'll just hit those. All creatures. There we go. And we still have this as well. Nice. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. But we can do ours for six. And we also, on top of that, have Vigilance. We can double block here on a bunch of this stuff. We'll see what they're going to do. They're not going to do anything, which is just fine. Um, we also have this. Mills three times, which is 15 cards. Um, we have our Doppelganger again, if we want to do that. We could draw a card. I'm actually going to go to the face. Not to that. Draw two unless we discard. Ooh, we could go for that. Better go for the face, though, I think. Go here. There we go. Titan. Let's do this. Dad. Get the Titan on. So here again is where you can do doppelganger on this thing. So we got four, six. Only get two through. Not lethal yet. Let's see here. There. Reach and trample. Rhino and gain five life. Or destroy artifact. So we can look. One of the two. Let's get a little crazy. Let's do it. Uh, put a shield counter on a creature we control. And let's do that. Four here. Let's cancel actually because we'll pull a four and look at that. Quite yet. Now, if they reset the board, we do have a few things here we'll be able to use. For the creature. Nice. Oh, we did not have four. We could have went pleated, that's why. It's okay. Now, if we attack in, the llama thing makes everything bigger here. So this is how we can clean up the board a little bit, um, making these three threes for the most part. If we do it, we have enough to make everything else bigger than that. So four, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's nine. 
I eight. No, oh, we need ten. What I think we need. Let's do that. Get this thing down Emotions here. Emotions are distractions. Focus on the facts. Organic minds are easily quelled. Ooh! Oh, they got him. Too much noise. This gets the 5-5. Five, five. Ooh, there you go. Alright, so we can make more here. We can make this exile out the one target creature. Turn that creature to the battlefield under its owner's control. Double striker. Still not quite lethal here. We can do a double here. And then let us make some of these things just a little bit bigger, huh? That give me not enough yet. And to Fury will keep that. Alright. So we also have enough to make everything a little bit bigger. Let's see what they hit. Oh, it doesn't counter with Jen. Good. So now we have how many can we make? One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We can do twelve, which is at least three of those. That. Three, nine, eleven, yep. Let's copy this. Let's copy if this when it enters X. I don't know if it's gonna do X there. We'll see. Um let's grab this one. And then we'll grab that one. So because we did that <laughs> I don't know if you caught that. Let's go back. Um because that was awesome. Uh here's what I did. So because I hit that, right, and I pulled this, I was going to pull this off, we got three of, well, not only that. So the way that that works is you get, for each X target permits, create X tokens that are copy of that permit. So we got a multitude of copies there. So we got three of these and three of these and three of these. So that is how it works and why you're only running one of those. I probably should have said that at the beginning. Um, but that is a key component there with Doppelgang. So that, my friends, is absolutely how you blow out a match and have some fun. All right, we got to go to our third and final match here with this list. It is so much fun. All right, I'm having a blast with this one. Here we go. Demofro. Demofro. Alright, we can keep this. We have some board. Well, not really board wipe. Uh, we can dig. Oh. Enter surveil. Okay, let's do it. We'll try it. Ooh. It's just a four, though. Not a blue, though. 
or fewer. Let's get rid of it. Yeah, it's gonna be a fast match, just watch. We'll hang on to that one. Because at three, we can hit something in the air. Ooh. On a red aggro. Alright, we're hurting just a little bit here. Now we need a line. We didn't get the blue. And I was thinking about mulliganing. Let's see here. Ooh! Let's see what they hit. Ooh, fast priority. Alright, let's do it on this one. Gotta do it, my friends. There we go. Just to get the life back. Why did that? Might not be enough. The only play we had, though, fortunately. Could have played Teferi, I guess. That's true. Without the sun, I'll light your way. You are lucky this is a warning shot. Of a nine. Oh, that's game. Oh, could have played to Fury. Really, wouldn't have done much. Well, we would have had plus one. I guess plus one life. Could have got through to one more round if we look at our battlefield. Though we didn't have anything to wipe. So let's go ahead and close it out for today that second match was the ideal match plus we got to see so much stuff with this list absolutely ridiculous and a ton of fun like i said um very very diverse it does run over 60 percent nice job ivan on this thing um a couple things like we saw there in terms of uh potential changes you could also drop in some of the four drop wipes you saw our opponent play the wipe uh, with black so maybe you could go to four colors there um, as an example if you wanted to but nonetheless absolutely a fun one here for you um, with the new set so all in we did go one and two um, didn't quite get to the 60 percent a couple little things we could have done differently but overall i'm definitely around about 50 so um, really really like this one i hope you did too again lots of lands bant and super friends lots of cards so i hope you've enjoyed it and if you still got a question, if you got a comment, let me know because I love to hear from you as always. And feel free to swing by the Discord server, my friends, and join our amazing community. And with that, thank you. Thank you for tuning in today. I appreciate your support. Thank you for the likes and the subs as we continue to grow this community. And thank you to all of our members. Uh, we do have memberships available today. You can check those out. Something there for everyone. And on top of that, if you're looking for cards, we do have our affiliate links available to you. So you can, can uh, peruse and browse those as well. Um, and lastly, don't forget our socials, at me, chat me, as I like to say. I love playing your lists like this um, as an example. So please do uh, feel free to share and uh, holler at me, right? Um, so with that, get out there. Have some fun with your super friends in Bantlands and a 70-card list, my friends. Super exciting for some magic.